Hello everybody, hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to create straight stairs along with the handrail. So first I'm going to start with the step and for that I'm going to create a box in my top viewport. So I'll go to my create panel, click on the box and create my first step. Somewhere like that. Pretty simple. And what I'm going to do is create a cylinder for a handrail uh, and that also in my top viewport somewhat like that and creating the hat right click alright so I can adjust the height of it and I can go to my modify panel and create the height somewhat like that and I can adjust I hit W and move it just a bit upward so is that enough I have to reduce the radius I'll reduce it like that and and alright now what I can do is select both the cylinder and the box and I'll make the copy of it I'll go to my front viewport in this case right click and select vertex for grid and snap settings and I'll push this button to turn it on now from this point onwards I'll hold shift click and leave it on this point I'll select the instance option and let's say 9 and I'll click OK Now, as you can see, there's still, there's still one more thing left to do, and that is I can select my front viewport again and go to my create panel, select lines and shapes. I'll create a line. So, okay, I'll turn the snap setting off and click and drag here, like that right click to end it now if I go to my modify panel uh, let me go to <coughs> enable under the rendering rollout turn enable in the renderer and the view pool let's save and select the option rectangular well this option is available in 3ds max 8 uh, which is what uh, I'm using so I have this option I can bring this I'll go to my top viewport and bring this exactly on top of it like that and so that's the pretty pretty simple example and uh, still we can add or can spend more times to, I mean it, it depends so for the time being for this example this is enough and I can create a wall let's say uh, yeah let me create a box here just to add to the environment like this and for the height okay I can increase the height of it more and I can copy this part of the handrail I can go to my top viewport hold shift click and drag like this let's say instance okay so that's a tiny little simple example of creating split stairs along with the handrail so I, ho I hope you have enjoyed it Thank you for watching and goodbye.